Hey, how's it going? Today we're going to go over how to draw a wolf howling at the moon full body. I've actually done a video on this before, but just closing up on the head. Now we're going to do a full body. It's going to be sim simple, easy for beginners. So let's get started, okay? First thing I do here is I'm actually going to go over here to the kind of snout of the wolf right here and draw like a curve up. Kind of a, his mouth is aiming upward. Then I'm going to pull down right there for the kind of the top of the snout. Angle up here for the forehead here. Down. Curve here for kind of the ear. It's gonna be folded back right on his head. We're gonna curve up like so. And over here down, curve. Back over here, curve. And down the tail. So there's a reason why I'm kind of drawing it all the way down to the tail. It's because I kind of want to like get the whole body in, you know, so I can fit it on the page. Over here at the front, we're going to have a little bit of a V shape right here, like he's howling. Like he is howling. Down right there for the front of the lower portion of the mouth. Curve down here, out, up. Curve up here for the ear, kind of the part of the ear there. Line up. Line over here. Angle right there at the nose, triangle the nose. Out, up. Out, up, out. Down over here, curve back for kind of the hind leg. Don't forget, by the way, if you like learning how to draw, hit that like button uh, so we draw more wolves on the channel. I can do a bunch of them if you want. Also, definitely hit the subscribe button. Click the bell notification if you're kind of big on uh, you know, learning how to draw. I do a drawing lesson every single day. And I'm going to start going into iPad drawings All right. as well. I'm going to, in addition, curve right here in the front down so that's gonna be the front leg go over here now curve right here back of the elbow downward so we're going down and now I'm gonna find the pause curve right here curve right here curve right here up nice go over here pull in down curve out Right on. Pull line in there a little bit because it's uh, the paws a little bit thick. So right here we're gonna follow the lower portion of his body. We're gonna pull inward. And now around this area, I'm gonna actually pull a curve here for the hind leg. Okay. In curve. Back over here. Down. Down. Line over here, downward, curve, curve, down, curve over here, down, curve, curve, curve for his foot, now standing in the back there. And now from the tail, we're going to go over here and we're going to curve and zigzag up. It's got that furriness to it. Don't forget, uh, if you like learning how to draw something that's cute, okay, like kind of a cute character, um, it's not really this topic, he's kind of cute, but I go over the proportions of cute. Uh, it's going to be in a free ebook. You have to look in the description for that. It's completely free. Uh, basically, I talk about kind of like how to format uh, cute, and it's really, uh, you know, simple. It's like 10 pages. And all you have to do is look at it and you understand like the bigger head, you know, smaller eyes and then proportions. So go ahead and download that totally, totally free. Look, you got to look in the description for that. Let's go over here and draw the hill he's on. Line over here. Line up like he's on a mountainside. Over here. And to be honest, it's just kind of any jaggedy cliff is good. 
zigzag over here, line over here, down, 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 line up, line up, right on. Now let's draw like a circle here in the back, okay? So we're gonna draw the moon in the back that he's howling at. So if you have issues drawing a circle, I understand some people do, you can either turn the paper, right? Slowly as you as you can do that uh, to kind of get better leverage um, or you can do it in pieces. So for example, let me draw a curve right here. All right, this chunk of a curve, let me continue slowly. It'll kind of give you some control keep drawing right and you have a chance to look at it and evaluate as you're drawing it to get something close <sighs> right on We've got the moon right there and we want to make we want to draw a little bit of the texture of the moon so we're gonna draw like a circle here with a thin line circle here larger circle here circle here circle here circle here zigzag over here for kind of the wolf's uh, mane in that area line 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 over here line down here and there we go that is a wolf howling at the moon uh, for extra stuff you can kind of go over here and draw the nails Line there, right there, right there. Down, down over here. Down over here. Down over here. Down over here. You can kind of always add stuff. Basically, the detail is kind of these thin lines over here. And uh, if uh, don't forget we have coloring books. Kind of looks like a coloring book page, right? If you like coloring books, there are cat coloring books. There are dinosaur coloring books uh, I'm putting out. They're on Amazon. Go to the first link. It's going to take you to the Amazon page with all my coloring books. Go take a look. Uh, pick one up. Um, thank you so much. I appreciate it. All the love that has been, you know, I've gotten from you guys. You guys are amazing, and I hope you have an amazing day. Okay, everybody? Talk to you soon.